Berman, creator of the Drop Dead Diva on Lifetime. And Josh, I wanted to know, how did you get such a fabulous idea for Drop Dead Diva? The inspiration for the character of Jane was actually my grandmother, who uh, was a four foot 11, plus size, survivor of the Holocaust. But she carried herself like she was a supermodel. And I love the fact that nothing could stop this woman from getting anything she wanted. And she certainly didn't let uh, her body deter her from anything. And uh, she has unfortunately since passed away. Her name was Deb, Deborah, and uh, as a homage to her, I named the character Deb. And I thought, but I can't exactly go around to a network and pitch the story of my Jewish grandmother. So instead, I created the character of Jane, who had Deb's spirit inside of her. And that was the genesis of Drop Dead Diva. Awesome. All right, so now what I was just talking to you about is just that so many of us have been really positively affected by how fabulous Jane is, but she's not your typical skinny model. And how have people been coming up to you and you know kind of mentioning that to you at all? <laughs> um, that makes me so happy that you're asking that question, uh, especially since um, you know on television, if you didn't know, if you were an alien looking at TV, you'd think that the size two was average. And the truth is, in America today, size 14 is average. Uh, but the clothing designers considered size 14 to be plus size. So so when you think about that, it's a bit odd that you don't see more realistic looking women on TV. And uh, I'm thrilled to be able to create a show where we have a normal, beautiful woman at the center who's not a size two. Um, the, I think the moment that was most gratifying for me is I have a friend who's actually at this event tonight who's a second grade teacher. And uh, last Thanksgiving, the students went around the room to say what they were thankful for. And one girl who probably didn't have the best body image said she was thankful for Drop Dead Diva. And to me, that meant the world. Wow. And in second grade. Second grade. That's unbelievable. We're, we, we get so many crazy images and messages as little girls. So, so thank true. you for the little girl in my heart yeah. for making this just be fabulous. Thank you. I love it. Thank you so much, Josh. Oh, you're so welcome. So happy you're doing this.